Hi and welcome to Duran's Designs review of the Porter Cable 20 volt max 18 gauge cordless brad nailer kit. I picked up this brad nailer on Amazon. It came uh, very quickly within about three or four days. It's well packaged. It comes with some nails, a couple different sizes. So here's the main unit here. It's fairly light, but well built. Comes with a clip for hanging. Here's the battery. It's a 20 volt. Comes with a charge, so you can use it right away, out of the box. And there's a small charger. Comes with it in this kit. Comes with an owner's manual. It's pretty straightforward. Has a very nice feel in the hands. Very smooth. Not too heavy. Okay, so uh, installed the battery and uh, We'll just go over a little bit uh, the features. You just there's a little button on the back. It slides out the tray where you can put in the brad nails, different sizes. You got the front uh, clip there that you can open up and get access to the front of it if you get a jam. You need to take some of the nails out and push them out that way. Like I said, it comes with a few nails to get you started, a couple different sizes. And you turn it over, load the nails with the point on the bottom, right up to the edge, and then slide the chamber closed. Okay, so you got a safety switch here. The prevents unwanted firings. Pretty quiet. It takes a second to charge up. Gotta press down firmly. And then pull the trigger. Wait a few seconds, press down firmly, pull the trigger again. That's the nice thing about a brad nailer, is you can pull out uh, the board and they'll come right out because they don't have much of a head on them. They're good for glue ups. I'll give a, another demonstration here so you get an idea. Turn your safety switch back on, and you're good to go. So, uh, as I'm a CNC channel, I thought I'd show how I could use this with my CNC machine. Uh, this wouldn't be good for every situation, but if you need a quick clamp down, this is one way you can do it. You want to go right to the edge as far as you can so you're not going to hit the nails with your bit and then you might need to cut off the edges so maybe make the board a little bit bigger than what you actually need four uh, nails did pretty good to hold that solid but it still came off pretty easy the nails mostly get left in the spoil board and then you just take a hammer or a pair of pliers and pull them out. So I hope you liked the review of the Porter Cable 20 Volt Max Kit. Please like and subscribe. 
and we'll see you next time.